Malaysia's 14th general election is over and the country's political transition is gathering steam. The country's new, yet familiar, prime minister is busy creating councils, launching investigations and naming ministers. As the building blocks for the new administration are being laid, many of us are still trying to make sense of the election, its implications, as well as what we can learn about how Malaysians voted and why. To read the full article you have reached one of our premium stories. To continue reading, get access now or log in if you are a subscriber. What is premium? New promotion with the Straits Times for a limited time, get a Google Home or a Google Home Mini when you subscribe. Learn more.